the kisses of the sun with sweet I like that cute little giggle <laughs> that was that was Stephanie with her cute little giggle oh you saw we got band. Stella, get ready. Canada's got talent right here oh yeah that's what? right. I feel like it's because we feel like, yes, oh, let's go. Yeah, yeah. yeah right? La, 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 la. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. Remember? This is like, so every once in a while, Tammy and I will send each other with Giancarlo, one of our cameramen, and, yeah. and Alfie. We have like this group chat and we just send music. Yeah, just random yeah. songs. This but would it's all be like, one of the songs. This would be one of the songs. It's all dance music. Yeah. Yeah. Like dance yeah. music. You guys, like you guys do the Woodbridge track. Oh, yeah. I get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's what it is. Get you going Would you say Giancarlo and Alfie? Mm. Who are like mm. hardcore oh, Italian yeah. dudes? Yeah, yeah, I know exactly what yeah. the tracks are talking about. Love. Remember Alfie? Yeah. Yeah. Morning. We, we love, love the beats. It. Wednesday, morning. we're getting over the hump. <laughs> getting over the hump today. Yeah, let's hump, do hump. this. Welcome yeah. back to the show. Okay, Stella, Tam, Yay. Steph, Don. Look at this. This is a, a good-looking couch. Couch today. <laughs> couch today. Couch today. Good. Um, you know what you have to check on for couches? Not on this oh. couch. Oh, please. But every now and then, you got to check out for bed bugs. Look, Toronto. We love when we win things, right? We love it. But being the champ of bed bugs in Canada for the fourth year in a row, <laughs> no. no. It's not what we want to celebrate, mm -hmm. but it's true. Name the number one city in Canada for bed bugs. Yeah, the six is at the top of the list. Yeah, everybody's starting to feel squirmish right now. Uh, squeamish, I guess, is what the word is. Uh, pest removal company Orkin released the list based on the number of commercial and residential bed bug treatments ordered last year. Uh, Toronto Public Health saying bed bugs are not considered a health hazard. What? Because but, they don't tra because they don't transmit disease. I okay, believe, but they may the cause main. skin infections, yeah. allergic reactions, a lot of stress, and a lot of anxiety elsewhere in Ontario. Sudbury at number three, and the dirty, dirty as it used to be known, Oshawa, is at number <laughs> four. When you go to a hotel, because this is the one that is, is a lot of people are getting guilty of, mm -hmm. hotels. Do you check for bed bugs immediately? Always. I never uh, check. Always. Always. I never yeah. check always. because I never, I never. I mean, I never go to a place where I, where there will be bed bugs. I'm in like that you four, think. four or five stars. It smells good in the hallways. Walk no, in, look clean. Steph, come from anywhere. Stella, we don't want to so break it to you. Break Steph. it down. We don't want to oh break it gosh. to you, but uh, bougie places have bed bugs oh, too. Yeah. 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 Okay, oh, no. They're I'm just bougie bed bugs. Ew, I don't want those ones either. They're high in taste. Yeah. 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 Stella, yeah. you have some inside right, info right, yeah. for us here, though. Yeah, so I used to be a flight attendant, and I'm a little extreme. Like, I'll even leave my bag outside. I know this is so weird. I leave my bag outside until I've checked everything. I don't even want yet. my bag in that room, right? Mm, wow. So what I do is I'll, like, go into the room. First of all, I always check behind the blinds, not for bed bugs. I just check. Right, just to see Make if sure anybody's no hiding. No one's hiding. hiding. I know. Yeah. I know that's. But you hear these horror stories. Right, hiding in the, I don't want to be able to check. Yeah. yeah. And then I go and I'll check under the mattress. So I like. <laughs> she's laughing. Like, what do you think is meant there? <laughs> well, you know. I mean, you're a flight attendant. You, know, you go to a lot of hotels, yes, right? Like the layovers, across, across, across the, the country. World. So, yeah. So yeah. yeah, across the world. So you just never know. And then I check under the mattress, and you actually have to pull the sheets off. You have to pull the sheets off and check, mm -hmm. like, in the creases of the mattress and everything. Behind the headboard, if there's a couch, you want to, like, lift up the pillows. You want to look behind the couch as well. So, Ooh. yeah. 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 See, for yeah. me, if it's not obvious, like, fine, I'll look at the sheets. But I kind of don't want to know what's under right. the mattress. Until you're like, yeah. I can't. It's not just that. I'm, like, <laughs> legit worried what I might find yeah. under the mattress. Yeah. I okay. really don't want to know. So I'm, uh, I'm okay with burying my head in the sand, lifting up the yeah. sheets, Nope, I don't see anything visible. If it's not obvious, I'm going to assume we're okay. But I am not lifting up mattresses. I am not looking under beds. Well, I just, my, I would rather not know. Because so, you. you're the queen of checking. So yeah. how many times have you actually found? Never. Okay. Okay. Yeah. That's good. That makes me feel better. Yeah, maybe I'm just that's not good. checking well. well no, 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 Blinds. <laughs> no. Okay. Yeah. So, no. Thank God. Thank God. Thank God. <laughs> Tam, you go to a hotel, you think it everything you notice, and I let you guys go to a nice hotel, and you're gonna stay the night, and you pull back the sheets, and you start searching, you find the bed bugs. What do you do? I'm out oh. immediately. Oh, oh, like, oh wow, like I, I, like, like just a puff of smoke. Where Are you out of that hotel or just that room? Do you ask them no, the hotel. What are you gonna do? I'm out of the hotel. Completely. I think yeah. uh, because they transfer, right? Yeah. So Very if easily, bed bugs have been yeah. there then what's not what's 
what's to say they're not next door? The sheets uh, could be washed. Yes, that's fine. But mm -hmm. one survives, two survive, and they just repopulate. They're not going to things. different rooms, are they? I they mean, can. they can only yeah. transfer based so, on luggage but, and but shoes think, and clothes. Person, what I always person? think is, how about even on an airplane? Like, just think about it. If people mm -hmm. are going from hotel, they're bringing the bed bugs onto the airplane. Is there a risk of that as well? Exactly. Should we be checking the airplane seats? I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to be itchy all day. I'm going to say, I'm gonna say <laughs> this. I, I was renting a place not too far from here for a little bit because I was kind of selling one place, moving to another. So I rented an apartment for three months. And all of a sudden, I was like, man. I woke up one morning. I had a couple. I'm like, what is going on? No. So. Get somebody to come check and everything. There was bed bugs in that apartment. <laughs> However, <laughs> this was six years ago. Six years ago, you're good. I'm clean. They fumigated everything, including my body. Don't worry. Um, but it came through the vent from another unit. Oh, yeah. Is how they discovered oh. it. Because the owners of that were like, "No, man. Like we have no history of anything like this." And mm -hmm. I'm like, "Well, it's some." And they found it. They kind of traced it back, and it was in another unit. I believe and it. it was the worst experience because it's. You have to like clean everything out. You got to mm -hmm. throw out a bunch of things. I want to set everything on fire. Like you know what I mean? Like it's it's, it's and you don't yeah. want to bring it yeah. home with no. like that is my yeah. nightmare. But then, the, but then yeah. there's that stigma of that total mm. stigma. You're dirty. No one wants to be around you. Like it's a whole thing, man. So, anyways, Toronto, congratulations, four <laughs> years in a row. And here's the other thing. They said the most commercial residential treatments. We have the biggest volume as well, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. We are the most populated city of all of these on the list as well. So with that, you're going to get that kind of number as well. So let's just mm -hmm. put that in perspective yeah. okay. from that. All right? You're all still right. dutty like in certain spin. places. Though. I like the spin. Yeah, yeah. you're still, still dutty <laughs> in some places. Yeah, clean things up. Yeah, yeah, thanks. Okay. Thanks, thanks. <laughs> all right.